Hello everyone. In this lesson, you will be able to learn how to skip count by fives, tens, and hundreds using a number line. So in prior lessons, we did talk about a number line and how it works, how we have to count on when we are adding, count back when we're subtracting. In this case, we are just going to fill in the blank to figure out what number comes next. As you see here, in this case, they are counting by fives. So here you look at the, the, them counting by fives. So it would be the one that will be changing would be the ones place. Always pay attention to that. What is the place value that is changing? There will be a time when the place value changes in the tens place and then it goes back to change again in the ones in the ones place and then in the tens place. So you just gotta pay attention to what is changing. As you see on this other side, the one the one place value that is changing is the hundreds place. So here the 400 is going to become 500, 600, and so on, all the way to 1000. Now let's try doing um, this number line and complete it. So if I am going to complete it, first I need to see what is the place value that is changing and what are we counting. So I have to examine here the one place value that is changing is the play, the ones place and then it changes to the tens place. But I see that it is counting by fives. So it's from 400 to 405, 405 to 410. And if I know how to count by fives, it will be easy for me because I will just go and I will go to count on. It would be 400, so I keep the tens place, the, the hundreds place, and I just need to change the ones place. So 415, again I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep the hundreds place, and I'm going to go into the tens place, which is going to be 420. So I just need to remember what um, I need to change and how I'm going to count. In this case, it will be 0, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So I keep my hundreds place. And I want you to try the rest. Go ahead and pause the video and try it on your own. So yes, I would keep the hundreds place. And then I'm going to count on. I have to remember what's after 25 plus when I'm adding 5. So it will be 25, yes. 30. I have to add 5 more. 430. I keep the hundreds place. 4 in the hundreds place and then I go 30. It will be 35. It just takes practice. So I want you to try it and practice counting by fives, which is going to help you when you have your number line. Practice counting by hundreds, practice um, counting by tens. And if you find this video helpful, please share it with your friends.